everyone, Lisa here with 7 Touch Marketing and today I want to talk about what on earth all the statistics with your email marketing really means. Let's decode those statistics. Now if you are using email marketing right now and not looking at the reports afterwards, you are missing out on the biggest gold mine that email marketing has to offer. So let's go through each of the things that you should be able to learn in the reports. Um, and let me just add that Constant Contact has a super robust reporting function and that's if your email program doesn't have this much reporting you need to look into Constant Contact. Alright, so the first thing of course that you'll get is how many emails you sent and that's useful of course. Um, and a feature that I love about Constant Contact is that you get the number. So let's say you sent out 997 and it'll be underlined and in blue and what that means is you can click on that number and see exactly who received the email. Awesome! Okay, uh, you should also get bounced. So a bounce is uh, it, it got kicked back, right? So is uh, another thing cool about Constant Contact is it will tell you why it bounced. So you don't have to guess which email addresses are right or not. Because you don't want to automatically um, remove the email addresses of your bounces. Some of them are um, on vacation auto replies. Some of them are the uh, mailbox is full. Some of them are undeliverable addresses and you need to know the different reasons. So when I look at my bounced list, and let's say I had 42 bounces, I can go in and see exactly which emails bounced and why they bounced. It's a great way to keep your list nice and clean. Um, another one that you'll get is opens. A lot of people read their email addresses in the preview pane. That means that you have the list of emails on the left and a preview of the one that you're, you have highlighted on the right. You never have to open the email in order to read the email. Um, so when I am scrolling through and I scroll through and land on your email and I read it in the preview pane, you have no data. You don't know that I saw the email. What you, when you do know that I saw it is two things. Either I double click on the email and it opens in its own window, that's an open, or if I enable the pictures. So a lot of email providers are now um, not delivering the images automatically. So what you'll see instead is a little box, a little box with a red X in it like that, right? Um, that means you need to click, right click and uh, download the images or in, uh, in uh, some of the other programs that there's a little button that says download pictures. When I download the pictures or right click on the X, then it's also an open. So I get to see how many of my sent emails were actually open and let's say that it was 369. Sent bounced and opens are three of the most important things you can look at. The number one most important thing is clicks and guess what? Here's the cliffhanger. Next video is going to be all about clicks. This is Lisa Smith reminding you to never lose another lead.